Welcome to the wonderful world of chemistry. Today, with the help of the Iron Set by Mel Chemistry, we will study the chain of chemical transformations of iron. Perform this experiment on a plastic tray to contain any possible spills. Don't forget to put on protective gloves and goggles before doing the experiment. To open a bottle containing a reagent, push the cap down and turn it. Pierce the bottle nozzle with an unbent paper clip. For the amazing iron experiment, you will need iron powder, solutions of citric acid, potassium ferrocyanide, and hydrogen peroxide a pipette, a measuring spoon, and a petri dish. You will also need a disposable cup from your starter kit. Prepare some water and a magnet in advance. Put one big spoon of iron powder into the disposable cup. Then add one bottle of citric acid and wait five minutes. The iron powder will react with the citric acid yielding ferrous citrate and hydrogen, which is released in the form of bubbles. Take the Petri dish. Apply a magnet to the base of the cup to collect the unreacted iron. Stir the cup to make all the powder stick to the magnet and pour all of the solution out into the Petri dish. Using a pipette, add some water until the solution completely covers the bottom of the Petri dish. Then, add some drops of hydrogen peroxide to various spots in the Petri dish. Hydrogen peroxide oxidizes ferrous ions to ferric ions, forming a yellow solution of ferric citrate. Don't forget to close the bottle of hydrogen peroxide. Now take the solution of potassium ferrocyanide and add some drops of it to various places in the Petri dish. It will react with ferric ions yielding the insoluble deep blue precipitate, Prussian blue. To repeat the experiment, wash the Petri dish. Learn more about this experiment on our Mel Science website.